better. Yay, happy to be on camera again with your big pink bow. Yeah. Yeah. Hi guys and welcome to Vlogmas Day 2. So I'm really excited again for this video, all the festive feelings at the moment. Um, and in today's video we are going to be doing up and decorating our kitchen and hallway in all the crest, crest, Christmas festive decorations. I don't actually have too many decorations for in the kitchen or in the hallway, it's mainly the banister in the hallway anyway. And this year I bought a load of garlands to do the window in here that I didn't do last year, I couldn't do. I also don't have but want to pick up, and hopefully I will get before the end of this video, um, some bows or decorations for the two big gold lights as well. I need to change out my flower arrangement that's over there in the corner. Sorry, you wanted to be center of attention, as always. Okay, <laughs> and your lovely cardigan that Nanny knitted you. Your great Nanny knitted you. Uh, yeah, gonna get cracking at decorating our kitchen. As we go along as well, I'm sure we will fill you guys in, but otherwise I'm gonna pop you on time lapse, as always at the moment, that's yesterday's and today's video. Um, and probably because, oh, she's gonna be screaming at some point, I'm gonna put on some cartoons for her to watch so that I can do it in peace-ish. Right, let's get cracking at the decorating. Okay guys, so I have popped up. My little bell's kind of hard to see at the moment. Uh, but they're up, really cute and pretty. Now I'm just gonna add some fairy lights onto these and then I think I'll put, I have two more of the eucalyptus garlands so I'm gonna pop them on this. Okay, so that is up, not looking too bad. So as you walk in, of course, we have somebody who's on Wild Awake. Hi Wild Awake lady. And yeah, so the kind of two leafy bits. As I said, I want to get the bows to go on here then, they really cute. So I have some orange slices up there, you can kind of see them. And let's just see. Right. So I'm gonna do some more and just kind of have them drip in there, I think, because in a kitchen having food actually as decoration is quite clever. I quite like that idea, if I do say so myself. But uh, yes, so I'm gonna make some more of these. I'm gonna get some bows for here. Now I'm going to set up um, a little corner over here uh, with some decoration, decorations and jars for tea bags and stuff. Oh, also I wanted to show you guys, this is what I have been using to tie everything up. I got it in that tiger shop, although it's definitely in England as well and it was in Portugal, so I think it'd be quite in a few places, but it's just nylon string, but it was clear string, which is so handy for putting up decorations. Um, what else I want to show you? Yeah, please excuse the absolute dirt of my windows. I don't know, has anybody else got this problem, okay? So I did clean them, well, I was actually like 38 weeks pregnant. 37 weeks pregnant? I don't know, but I cleaned them then, so it has been like five and a half months, maybe six months at this stage, so I do need to do them again. Now this window has the seal gone, so I can't help with that. But these specks on the outside and inside, do you know what that is? That's cat sneeze and snot. Genuinely, that is cat snot. Okay, not only my cat, but the cat outside as well. We have a stray cat that goes around all the houses here. And slobber and sneezing on our windows. Like, I had just cleaned these and he done it and I just refused to clean them again. Um, but yes, yeah, so that's what that is, cat snot. Mm, lovely. Uh, but yes, so I'm going to rearrange this now. Okay, so this is my little Christmassy corner. This does light up, so when I get batteries in it, we pop them in. We have my little tea and sugar in there. 
many different parts. So I've just swapped out to this. I could change it, but for now, I think it's just enough. And then this sign, I have another sign as well, but it's for the hallway. But I might pop it in here if I don't use it. So, so for now, I think I've done pretty much all I can do in the kitchen. So I'm gonna move on to the hallway. Okay, it looks really blue on camera at the minute. There. So this is our hallway currently. Um, loads of coats on the banister. So I'm gonna take them off and decorate the banister. Mostly that's the main thing to do here. I wanna get some ribbon for the picture frames maybe. But for now it's the banister mostly. Could find something to stick up here. That black dot up in the corner is our doorbell that doesn't work. Um, it's our old doorbell. And then this is the sign that I was on about that we would use either in the kitchen or in here. So not sure um, where we're gonna remove that yet. Excuse me, you just dropped your dummy. Not too bad. Not that mad at it. Yeah. We've given it an attempt. Um, oh, I need to push it. Push it. Oh. Okay guys, so I just popped a red bow on this plant, so you can hear everyone in the background. Um, but uh, I just popped a red bow on this plant because of it spread too far otherwise. Uh, but yeah, so I think it looks quite cute in the corner here. I had to get out of the other room anyway, so. This is the look of our hallway so far. I probably will add to it over the months, over the month, months. And obviously the ceiling decorations that went up in the end. Really happy with my sort of like old fashioned style decoration. <laughs> uh, I put the wreath up, the garland up in the end. I don't have any decorations on it at the moment. Again, I'll add to it uh, during the month. Hopefully in the next week or two, we are going shopping. So I'll be able to pick some decorations for that. I just still don't know really kind of what to go for at the moment. I'm thinking white or gold. Um, but yeah, I'm just not too sure. And then we had a spare wreath as well, no, a spare garland um, that I've turned into a wreath, just one big wreath and put baubles on it and made a big red bow that was actually a tablecloth, um, which is a net tablecloth, uh, which I just folded into a big bow uh, on top. So it's something, it's not the most stylish looking thing, but I think it's like really effective when you come in and you sort of look down and you just see some nice decorations. <laughs> you just see sort of a, a big decoration right here. It was just a blank wall, so I'm happy with how it turned out. Um, and then I'm just gonna do from this angle because I love how it looks. You probably see the two big red bows. I did finally pick some up in the end um, and I do have to iron them. I haven't ironed them yet and I just have to snip these ones a bit more. They're a bit uneven. Uh, but love how these turned out. They're exactly how I wanted. Oh, I have to twist this one around as well, but essentially you get the whole vibe I'm going for. Uh, in here, then I did get some more oranges. Uh, one's fallen off, I have to pop it back on. <laughs> it sounds like such a disaster of a video, but you kind of get the look we're going for. It's the 1st of December, actually it's the 2nd of December today. So I have plenty of time. I have 23 days that I can keep adding to this stuff. And as I said, we are going shopping, so I can keep adding to it then. My lovely Zara Bells. Oh, that lighting is terrible. Now you can see them. The Zara Bells are there, which I am in love with. The Eucalyptus Garland, Wreath, Garland, Garland. Again, I'm never gonna remember which is which. It's always difficult. And um, that does light up, which I just love in the evening time. It's so pretty. Um, and then, yeah, just a normal flower display. Sorry, we have dinner over here. Michael has his advent calendar. We didn't pick up any for ourselves. We couldn't find ones that we liked. And now they're sold out everywhere, so we don't actually have one. Uh, but that's okay, as long as Michael has one for now, that's the main thing. 
Um, and then you've seen my little flower display with my tea bags and sugar. It doesn't look anything special from the back, but as you're walking in, I just love this whole statement look. It's probably my favourite part of the entire house is here. I'm wondering, do I leave it dangled down or will I tie it up along that? I'm not too sure. I don't know what I like more. But still, either way, I love it. Okay, please excuse the glistening of my hair. It's not grease, I swear. I want to round up this video now. Hopefully it's not too long for you guys. I'm trying to keep these videos quite short um, and just so you don't get sick of me by the end of Vlogmas, we are only day two and I'm really excited to keep going, but I don't want to take up too much of your time because I'm sure you're watching a few other people's Vlogmases as well. Um, I'm just glad that you're watching mine. Thank you so much for taking the time to click onto this video and for viewing it. If you did enjoy this video, please give it a big thumbs up and I will see you tomorrow. Bye.